Hey, what's good guys? It's Zach. Hope you all are doing well. Just a little while ago, I was scrolling on Twitter and I saw this tweet by Android Police. And in case you guys didn't already know, I do post videos on Android Police's YouTube channel, so make sure you check them out. Link down below in the description. But here's what the tweet says. Nova Launcher finally gets Google Now integration. This is huge. If you guys are like me and you use Nova Launcher most of the time, but you still like Google Now, again, this is huge. So before, you would have to use the, uh, whoops, I like slammed my phone on the table. You would have to use the actual Pixel launcher to get Google Now integration. But now the developers over at uh, whoever makes Nova Launcher, I forgot the name, uh, but they actually found a way to get Google Now in Nova Launcher. As you can see right here, I'm running it here on my S8 Plus. And uh, yeah, Google Now is right there on the home screen. And it, and it works beautifully it's awesome so I'm gonna go ahead and share with you guys how to pull this off alright so it's really easy all you have to do is head over to this link I will put it down below in the description don't worry go ahead and head over to this link and you've got everything you need make sure you read the article uh, thoroughly uh, but uh, it is really easy alright so we're gonna start off by downloading Nova Launcher 5.3 beta 1 and go ahead and hit the APK mirror right there it'll bring you directly to where you need to download it go ahead and scroll all the way down you've got download APK and while that's downloading we can go ahead and head back to this this article and we can go ahead and download the other APK that uh, the developer actually put out yes Tesla coil that's what I was trying to think of go ahead and scroll all the way down here and hit download APK that one will download as well and we'll be good to go all right so let's go ahead and install the Nova launcher beta right here if your phone does not have unknown sources enabled then go ahead and go into the settings unknown sources and uh, let's go ahead and get back to the install here it takes a couple of seconds there we go go ahead and hit done and then from there we can go ahead and download the other APK right here oh my goodness all right we have to do this again there we go and this is actually called the Nova Google companion so there we go go ahead and install that and we should be good to go so from here we can go to Nova launcher it'll set as our default and of course I have to go through this setup because I have not actually installed Nova launcher on this phone yet but I'm gonna go ahead and skip it and we should be able to get Google now on our home screen let's see and there it is it works it works beautifully on both of my devices now of course it is still buggy because this is very fresh this is very new uh, but over time it'll start to get really nice and smooth and work pretty much perfectly on all devices so there you go that's pretty much it I'll have links for these down below in the description so if you want to get Google now on Nova launcher this is huge I love it and uh, it gives me one less reason to use uh, the actual pixel launcher which is still nice don't get me wrong but I love using using Nova Launcher, as you can see, I got my setup the way I really want it to be. And uh, yeah, now I have Google Now on top of that, which I do use. Uh, so now I'll be using it more because I actually have it on my home screen. And so far, so good. It works really well. So there you go. Uh, I hope you guys got something out of this video. Let me know if it works for you guys. And uh, yeah, that does it for this video. I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.